Hello everyone and welcome to Instant Biology by Dr. Neelab. So this is the last lecture on the courses offered by IIT that are related to biotechnology and allied sciences. So you would already know that uh, we have already published two lectures in this series in which we have been talking about the different courses that are offered in IIT related to biosciences, biotechnology and other allied subjects. So this one would be the last lecture. We have covered all the IITs. After uh, you watch this lec lecture, you would be you would have covered all the IITs and the courses that are offered there. So let us quickly go through these uh, remaining IITs. After that, I am thinking of uh, uh, giving a series that provides information about the courses offered in NIT. NITs. Okay, so the first IIT that I would be talking about over here is IIT Jodhpur. Okay, so this is IIT Jodhpur. Let me just quickly write down over here. So this is the first one that we are talking about IIT Jodhpur. Okay, so what are the programs that are offered over here? So essentially there are two programs basically right so there are two programs that are offered over here one is only mtech degree and uh, this is mtech in just give me a minute yeah so this is mtech in bioengineering right so this is mtech in bioengineering let me just quickly shade this right so this is just a postgraduate degree in uh, bioengineering offered by iit jodhpur and these are in general the the introduction about the department the objectives the graduate attributes and uh, what all are the unique characteristics of the course that is offered by iit jodhpur that is a bioengineering course so you can go through this if you if you want and uh, apply to this course uh, depending upon your interest in in this mtech program now another option that you can opt for over here is mtech PhD dual degree now often students ask me that uh, is the dual program useful for you so in my opinion yes these dual programs are uh, very useful because you see you get to know the professor uh, pretty well during your mtech and uh, you you tend to develop uh, a understanding of the subject and understanding of the uh, research area that uh, he offers he or she offers so it comparatively becomes a lot more easier than uh, to continue your PhD if you compare it to a fresh uh, PhD candidate then he or she will have or uh, will require certain time to adapt to the scenario but an mtech PhD dual degree would in my opinion essentially require less time require less time so this is the best uh, uh, advantage that I think and uh, this is being offered by one of the previous premier institutes that is uh, an IIT so in my opinion you can uh, opt for this you can first of all uh, consult with the the, the supervisors and uh, then opt for this program so this is mtech PhD dual degree so there are two courses just the PG course that means just the postgraduate course or mtech course over here so this is first option the second option is mtech plus phd okay so this is another option so iit jodhpur is offering you two options so you can go through this next is iit patna so uh, this uh, remains this always remains a very uh, popular uh, IIT with the students from North India because this is situated in the northern India so IIT Patna basically is offering you mtech by research mtech by research let me just quickly underline this so mtech by research this is the program that is being offered the topic or the subject is chemical and biochemical engineering now this is the topic next thing over here is uh, what are the requirements so you can see this biotechnology that means if you have qualified gate with 
biotechnology then uh, there is no problem and uh, there is also if you have qualified gate then it is good but uh, if you haven't qualified gate that there is an also there is also option for sponsored or uh, part time students who want sponsored or part time program so uh, you would require a 2 years experience certificate with this so this is the um, uh, the course that is offered by iit patna i am tech by research in chemical and biochemical engineering so this was the only course that is offered by iit patna now coming to iit indore okay iit indore let me just quickly write it down third is iit indore okay so uh, actually a uh, not uh, i mean to say you, you cannot go into iit indore because uh, they are not offering a mtech program so mtech is not available however i would also like to bring to your notice that there is an msc program nowadays uh, the gat b notification is out and many of you would be filling the form for gat b for going into mtech and msc courses so that is why i brought this uh, to your notice that uh, this basically iit indore generally takes admissions to M msc biotechnology with gat b that was the scenario with of uh, 2021 you can uh, check the website uh, for uh, the latest updates on 2022 but this was the scenario for msc positions or msc seats uh, in iit indore that was through gat b okay so this is uh, the important thing i and uh, yeah so one more important thing over here that even the btech students can opt for uh, the msc degree however i don't know how much it is feasible for you so bachelor's degree it can be of three years that is bsc four years that is btech and also for five years relevant in the relevant area of biology and biotechnology that means students who are who have done their bsc as well as btech and also agriculture can opt for uh, this uh, particular course in uh, iit indore right so this was the third college now coming to the fourth college that is fourth uh, institute this is school of uh, biochemical engineering institute of technology indian institute of technology bhu so this is bhu iit bhu and iit bhu offers admission to two courses okay yahan pe do courses ke liye admission hota hai so what are the courses let us just quickly go through this so this is school of biochemical engineering biochemical engineering and uh, an mtech course is offered in mtech biochemical engineering and uh, you can opt for this particular course if you are gate qualified apart from this there is also a PhD program that is available but since uh, we are interested in making the course for MTech only so this is the case okay school of biochemical engineering next is school of biomedical engineering now this is also I mean to say this is also from BHU only remember this this is also from IIT BHU only and uh, the school is school of uh, biomedical engineering what is the mtech degree that you would be getting so mtech program is of two years and the degree you would be getting would be of biomedical engineering okay so in this also uh, you should have a, a b b b tech degree in uh, uh, this uh, equivalent degree in biomedical ceramic chemical computer electrical so on and so forth okay so if you are a uh, if you have completed your b tech in biomedical so you can opt for this uh, mtech program offered by biomedical engineering a school of biomedical engineering so this was the fourth iit let us talk about the fifth one so this is uh, iit ism dhanbad so the previous name of the institute was ism dhanbad but now it is considered as an iit indian institute of technology dhanbad so what are the courses offered by ism dhanbad or iit dhanbad so first one is this is fifth iit ism dhanbad 
so this ism stands for indian school of mines so this uh, uh, the iit tag has been uh, attached recently pretty recently the old name was ism dhanbad so what are the courses that are offered over here let us quickly go through these pharmaceutical science and engineering so you would get an mtech degree in pharmaceutical science and engineering if you are opting for this the gate subjects that are eligible are bt this is a uh, and also excel so both the prime fields in gate uh, are eligible bt and excel over here you can see the biotechnology students the people who have done their btech in biotechnology can opt for this apart from this there is also a course in environmental science and engineering that again takes in bt uh, people who have appeared gate with bt over here also students from biotechnology are eligible be btech if you have done in biotechnology you are eligible to go for environmental sciences and engineering apart from this students who have done their msc degree in biotechnology are also eligible or msc tech if you have done in biotechnology then also you are eligible so with this we come to the end of uh, this particular lecture and uh, this particular series so there are three series let me just quickly uh, summarize this so there are c three lectures in the iit series three lectures in the iit series for the mtech programs for the mtech uh, biotechnology and allied sciences programs if you want i can make uh, the series on nits also so kindly comment in the uh, description so kindly comment in the box provided and uh, i would be making more lectures like this so if you like the lecture just press the like button and subscribe to my channel thank you so much have a good day ahead